Hi, this is Barbara, and welcome back to Wikidesign. In today's video, we are going to talk about Lottie animations. Lottie animations are small, JSON-based animation files that work on any device and can be scaled without losing quality. Believe it or not, Lottie was created by Airbnb. Yes, that Airbnb. These animations are fun and eye-catching, and when added to your website, will give it a neat interactive element. I got to recently add Lottie animations to a website redesign that we did for one of our clients. I love how the animations add a fun interactive element to this design. If you're interested in learning more about this project and seeing what the site looked like before our redesign, you can click the link to the portfolio page in the description box below. A few months ago, Elementor added a Lottie widget to their page builder that makes adding Lottie files to your website really easy. In this video, I'll show you how easy it is to add Lottie files to your site using Elementor. Before we get started, are you entered into our giveaway to win a free $5,000 website? All you have to do is subscribe to this YouTube channel and fill out our official entry form. We'll put a link to that in the description box down below. You need to make sure that you enter before December 31st. So pause this video, go over and fill out that entry form and make sure you're subscribed to this YouTube channel for your chance to win. Okay, let's get back to the video. The first thing that you'll need to do is download your Lottie file. If you're an animator and know how to use After Effects, you can create your own Lottie animations. Airbnb has lots of documentation on how to do this, and I'll put a link to that in the description box. If you're like me and aren't an animator but still want to use this for your website design, you're in luck. There are hundreds of animations available at LottieFiles.com. This site has both free and paid downloads and gets updated all the time with new animations. This is a great resource for finding fun Lottie animations for your next project. Once you've found the perfect Lottie animation, you'll want to download the JSON file. Before you do that, there is some options to change some of the settings such as background color or animation speed. What you can change really depends on the file and some files may have more options than others. After you've made your customizations, click the button that says download JSON. The next step is to open up the page that you want to add your Lottie animation to in Elementor Pro. For this example, I am using one of the Elementor Pro templates. I've loaded this onto the page and I would like to change this static image here with my Lottie animation. So I'm just going to remove this image and I'm then going to replace it with a Lottie widget. So I'll go over to my left hand side, type in Lottie, and then I'm going to drag this over and then upload my JSON file that I downloaded from the website. If I hit insert media, now my Lottie animation shows. It's that easy. There are some additional options you can change within the Lottie widget. You can set the alignment and have the ability to link to your Lottie file as well. Under the settings tab, you have the different viewport options, the ability to loop the animation, as well as the ability to change play speed, the start and end points, or reverse the animation. You also have the ability to render the animation as an SVG or canvas, and the ability to lazy load it onto the page. Over in the style tab, you're given additional options to set the width and the opacity. The advanced tab has the same options as any other Elementor widget, so if you need to make any advanced customizations, you can apply those changes here. I love that Elementor has added this widget to their page builder. They made it so easy to use and having this feature available will make website designs more interesting and fun. That's it for today's tutorial. If you liked this video, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe to this YouTube channel, and ring the bell to receive notifications whenever we post a new video. See you next time.